So I promised a review of the uh, APEC countertop system and so far I really like it. And anyone that comes over, they like it too. Um, they actually think it tastes like smart water. I've never had smart water, but I don't know. I think it's a good thing. I think it's expensive water, so you know, $230 for expensive water for life besides filter replacements, which I don't think is very expensive. But there it is behind me. Right there. And uh, I just have it filtering, you know, do do do. I normally have, well, let's get, let's get in the camera. I usually have this in the back of here. But what I actually want to do uh, right now is do a test. Um, most people say that the wastewater is two parts and the clean water is one part. You know, so you're wasting 66 percent or whatever of the water. But I don't think that's actually the case for mine. Uh, maybe since I have such a high water pressure, you know, it's actually putting out more of the clean water. But it looks like I'm getting more clean water than wastewater. So maybe like two thirds clean water and one third wastewater. So I'm actually going to do a test. I'm going to have two cups, uh, same color, or not, color doesn't matter, same size cup, and see which one overflows first. So let's get started. All right, so here is the cup test. Let's go ahead and turn it on, full blast. And the base water starts first. I don't know. I wonder if it'll win because it started first. <laughs> Is that still kind of spurting and said, there it goes. Will it catch up? camera's so shaky. Is it catching up? Let's see. It's definitely not two-thirds wastewater though. It's got to be, I guess, one part, one part. But I think yeah, I think the left side's passing. Clean water is passing the wastewater. Yep, there it goes, top of the rim. Well, not top of the rim, but the thick part. It's past there. That one's not even there yet. So I'm getting more clean water than wastewater, which I think is awesome. Some people are saying that it's not. Well, for me it is. <laughs> nah, I don't want to waste water. Uh, yeah, okay. So that's at the top. That, it, it did pass that little thing there. Um, ah! Ah. Don't want to waste now, do we? That's waste though. I'm gonna go ahead and get the, uh, ooh, since I have this out, I'm gonna get the testing meter real quick and let's see what the uh, parts per million. So, go ahead and turn on zero and let's do the clean one first. That way we don't pollute this meter. What? Hmm, every other time I've been testing, it's been like 10. Let's see. I didn't know it had already gone up. But it's been three weeks now, I think, since I got it. This is a three week review. Okay, it's back to zero. And this is usually in the thousands. Okay. Just 400s. <laughs> Still, though. It's getting out a pretty decent amount. Wash that off. Let's see what these water bottles are. Maybe the plastic is leaking or something. I don't know. Yeah, see in the glass, it measures at 12. It's usually like 10 or 11, but you know, 12 is fine. And let's check another one. And there's 11. 
Okay, so that plastic cup is probably just still got like grape juice or something in it. I don't know. I, don't, I guess it might not have washed it thoroughly. But it was empty. I don't even know if I showed them being empty in the beginning. But they were empty, I promise. <laughs> Anyways, um, that's my review. I love it. I think it's absolutely worth it. I mean, there's no reason, you know, not to get it if you want clean, purified water. Wait, buying bottle water, bottles of water is a waste. You're just buying plastic. When you could buy this once, replace two of the filters six months to a year, and the other ones two years to five years. I mean, <laughs> come on now. Anyways, have a good day, and go vegan.